In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to enable document viewing, editing, redaction, page manipulations on PDF, MS Office, images, and other file types in Appian. We're going to go ahead and do it with PDF Trans Web Viewer that runs completely client side in the browser within the Appian interface. So we know that there is no data ever leaving the Appian platform and we can process uh, document security within the Appian's environment. To get access to the Appian Web Viewer component, you can actually get it from the Appian Marketplace. Uh, go ahead, log in, and you can perform a cloud installation. Now, you will need a PDF Tron Web Viewer component. You will also need a connected system plugin to allow us access files directly from the Appian. So, right in front of here, uh, this is my kind of Web Viewer interface that I have set up. I dragged and dropped WebViewer as a custom component available from the bottom of the screen and I placed it on the screen right here. So first and foremost is the document viewing. I can open PDFs, MS Office, Images and others. I can also go ahead, annotate and collaborate on top of the document. Uh, for example, I can create a highlight, place a comment and go ahead and provide the reply on it to enable collaboration on multiple documents. Now, when I do hit this uh, save button right here, what it will do, it will update an existing version of this document and save all my comments that I have placed on top of it. And in terms of it, we have underline, strikeout, squiggly, comment, and free text annotations, number of shapes, inserting uh, images, stamps, and we can facilitate things like filling and signing forms, and a number of other features and capabilities I'm going to walk you through. Now, additionally, we have this page manipulation controller that from here I can actually drag and drop files directly from the desktop and you don't have to worry about whether or not initial format was PDF or MS Office. Once I load the documents in here and merge them, we will produce a PDF as an output. So regardless of the input file formats, I can merge rearrange pages, rotate, and so on. Another capability that I can do with PDF Trans Web Viewer is actually perform redactions. So redactions allow us to select the text and if I click apply, this text will be completely removed from the underlying documents. So it's no longer gonna be searchable. And unlike the redactions on other uh, viewers that you might have seen, that actually goes in and removes all the content on the lower level, removing all the elements like text, images, anything underneath those specific coordinates that you marked up for reduction. So as you can see here, I hit apply and all the reductions are permanent. It cannot be reverse engineered. Now I can go ahead and save this or I can actually save this as a new version by giving it a document name and saving it back to my knowledge center. Additionally, all the annotations and comments that are stored inside of here can be saved back to a database instead. So I actually created annotation data import and export. So in here I can save off the annotations that are almost kept as a separate layer on top of the document that allows us for further integration with the Appian ecosystem. Again, for all of the functionalities that I have mentioned, there is no data ever leaving the Appian ecosystem and all the processing is happening directly in your browser on the client machine. So in turn, you can ensure that you're going to have a secure document collaboration and page manipulation experience uh, directly within the Appian ecosystem. One of the other things that we can facilitate is actually ability to uh, perform functionality just like DocuSign. So where I can go ahead, open up a document and not just kind of fill in the form, but also perform signatures as well as digital signatures and place them on top of the document. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any more questions, feel free to reach out to pdftron.com and learn more about our offerings and solutions.